That is my last ghost grenade. So yeah. Nice. That was pretty good damage. That was over 20 damage from one proximity mine. I'll probably keep bringing proximity mines to every single mission now. Well, the sectopod is still a problem. That did not change at all. He's moving twice. Hi. Yeah, that's not something you want to see in your face most of the time. I'm just saying. I need to back up. And there's still a mechtoid as well. Yeah. And I'm out of ghost grenades. I don't even know how I'm going to finish this. I really don't. I could run around the map, but the problem is that Don can't really do it very well. I might have to move Don on this turn. Yeah. Well, maybe not on this turn yet, but I might have to move him soon. I'll prefer to not lose him. I can't toggle flight here. Yeah, there are obstacles in the way, apparently. Okay. Well. He can take a shot. But he's going to get killed if he doesn't move soon. I think I actually have to move him. I don't know. I don't like the idea of being shot by that sectopod. If the sectopod actually shoots down, he's going to die. Guaranteed. Really sucks that he can't land. If I move like this, he should be able to land. Let's change camera a bit. Like this. This obviously means I won't be able to take a shot on this turn. Come on. Two bit Sky Ranger. Okay, this should be good enough. I still can't toggle flight? This is really annoying, I have to say. Damn it. So, move or do what? I could use Science Inspiration to increase my will a bit, but that's a little bit pointless. Yeah, I don't like this. I can't move a whole lot. Well... That sector body is probably close enough to see him. Oh well. Not much I can do about that now. So, what's about that stupid sector pod? I'm pretty much out of ammunition. I don't have telekinetic field. I got two telekinetic fields, but this is still a lot of enemies. I just need to move out of the way. Yeah, I think I'll just have to move around a lot on this turn. I actually think Don will get killed, which is unfortunate, but I can't do anything to prevent that. I don't have the sibling shot anymore. No ammunition remaining. This mission was just ridiculous, to be honest. If this was a much bigger map, it wouldn't be such a big problem. But this map is tiny. So, Annette. I could take two shots at something. Oh yeah, that zombie in the back. I should kill it, otherwise it will transform into a chrysalid soon. There's no point shooting the sector for That's not going to do anything at all. At least not right now. It will just regenerate and or get repaired. So it's totally pointless shooting it right now. That will do nothing. Valentina needs to move. Right here. Probably. That's only partial cover. If I take two shots right now... Do I have any more? Oh, I still have more smoke grenades. Okay, I suppose I could take a shot. I could start doing damage to the sectopod. Where's Conrad? He's right here. Oh yeah, he's out of ammunition. Right. Okay, so he needs to move and reload. Now, yes, I know about the mutant elite. Jessica will have to kill it. Yep. Bye. 
So, start doing damage to the Sectopod? Possibly. Oh yeah, Emmanuel is also out of ammunition. I could stay in this general area. Maybe. If I move here, that's going to be safe. None of these aliens can actually flank me like this. At least not on the next turn. So, I'll stack telekinetic field and a smoke grenade. To start doing damage. Or I could destroy that mechtoid. Yeah, I need to get rid of the mechtoid first. 26 crit, awesome. Okay. Can I actually destroy that mechtoid on this turn? That would be great. Yeah, I actually can. Perfect. Bye. So. Smoke grenade and telekinetic field. Let's do it. I can't give a smoke grenade to everyone. But I'll give it to everyone in line of sight of the aliens. So, like this. And then I'll use telekinetic field. I still think the sector pod is going to kill Don. And I don't think Don has secondary heart. But there's nothing I can do about that now. If I lose Don, I'll just have to live with it. Okay, Annette can still take a shot, so I'll take a shot at the drone. Alright. Get rid of the drone. Out of over here. So, let's see what's going to happen now. That mutant in the back is still panicking. I think I'm left just with drones and the sectopod now. Well, and that panicking mutant. There might be one more mutant in the back. Okay, the sectopod is shooting Jessica. That's fine. Can it actually see Dawn? It might be just out of range. Yeah, I think it's out of range. Oh, what? There's a Seeker? Are you kidding me? What? Oh, the Seeker killed the civilian. Alright. I need one more turn to get Disabling shot. Okay. Start doing damage to the Sectopod. I can still use the Lekinetic Field on this turn. So that's probably a good idea. Bagels needs to reload. So, he can just stay there and reload. Yeah, I got telekinetic field on Annette, so I can take a shot and then use telekinetic field. I still got more smoke grenades. I am still getting smoke. It just looks a little bit strange, but I'm still getting smoke coverage. Yep. Okay, then. So... I need to start doing damage. The main problem here is that Conrad needs to see the Sectopod. And the Sectopod is using Overwatch right now, so I need to trigger that Overwatch. Best way to do it? I don't see a good way to do it, to be honest. I can run out here and then run back in. Maybe. That's probably the best way to do it. Okay, let's do it like that then. Please don't hit me. I like to live. I enjoy life. It missed. It will shoot me one more time when I run back. Yeah, it will shoot me again now. They have like four reaction shots, which is just ridiculous. It might end up hitting me. Yeah, 16 damage. I think that was the last one now. Okay, let's run back in. Now I can move with Conrad. So let's see how much damage we can do on this turn. I need to move Annette, actually. Well, hold on. If Conrad moves here, sh he should be able to shoot the Sectopod. Yeah. Hmm. I mean, I don't see why he wouldn't. Alright, let's move there then. I need to get Shader effect up. So let's make it happen. And then I'll need some nice hits. Yeah, two damage. The damage reduction on this sector pause is just insane. Which is why I need to get rid of the drones. Oh yeah, it's actually shooting me back. Yeah, because of that ability, whatever it's called. Okay, precision shot. To do some damage. 11 crit. Yeah, the damage reduction is just insane. Like, seriously? One more. And that got fully absorbed. That's just ridiculous. Reload. 
So Anet can still take a shot. Gerard will have to revive Conrad. Yep. Don't die, Conrad. I need you. Come back here. There's work to do, dude. Okay. Oh, he can actually use rapid fire again. <laughs> okay. Is he like floating me there or something? Is he out of cover? He's not standing on any specific tile right now, which is a little bit weird. Okay. Come on. Nine damage. I'll take it. So, Anet can shoot once and then use telekinetic field. Valentina can still shoot. 15 critical, nice. Okay. Am I right? Can Valentin uh, can Annette still shoot? Yes, she can. Okay, now telekinetic field. Like this. Oh, that was adaptive bone marrow on my scout. That's funny. Oh yeah, the drone will prepare the sector for a bit. How many drones are there? That's two drones. I need to destroy these drones. No, they are actually shooting me? No, the sector body is shooting me. It missed. Okay, I will have disabling shot on the next turn. I might actually be able to do this. But let's not get ahead of ourselves just yet. The muton is moving now. I'm not even worried about the muton all that much. Okay, I got disabling shot now. Can I afford to ignore the drones? I'd prefer to focus all my firepower on the sectopod. Okay, Annette needs to reload. She can't really do anything else on this turn. She can say panic the muton. Yeah, that's 100%, so might as well do it. Just to make sure the muton won't shoot me. Right, now. Conrad. Can I actually move Conrad? This is a little bit weird. I want to move him because he doesn't seem to be standing on any specific tile. Is he standing like on top of Valentina or something? <laughs> I have no idea. Like what? He's not getting cover. I have no idea what he's doing. I don't want to trigger that reaction shot. I'll just use disabling shot first. Okay, disabling shot. There we go. I won't destroy the sector pod on this turn, that's just not going to happen. What does it have? Hit and run, absorption fields. It doesn't actually have the shock absorbent armor, which is interesting. I could use running gun and then shoot it. From somewhere on here, maybe? There's still a civilian. Okay, first, Conrad. Rapid fire. I need to hit twice, so no misses. Three damage. And two damage, okay. Next up, Valentina. 100. Please do good damage. 10 damage, decent. I'll take it. Oh yeah, I have double tap on this turn. More! I think I'm going to ignore the drones. Probably. Girar. No need to use a smoke grenade right now. So, well, if Girar shoots the sector pod, he's going to do zero damage. He can just heal someone. If I'm going to use running gun with Jessica, I need to heal Jessica. That's kind of obvious-ish. Okay, let's heal Jessica then. It's a shame Gerard doesn't have paramedic. Alright. Bagels. Come here, bagels. 100. Alright, let's do it. Wow. 
That's actually insane. Like, seriously? One more? Please do some damage. Yeah, free damage. <laughs> this is actually crazy. Running gun. I need 100% chance to hit. I can move here. I would actually prefer the drones to shoot Jessica than repair the sectopod. Yeah, like legitimately, I would prefer them to shoot Jessica. Mutant is panicking, so I can ignore it. Alright, let's move like this. 50% chance to crit. I need crits here. Come on, don't disappoint me. 12 critical. And 9 critical. Awesome. Okay, I need literally two more damage. Well, more than that, because drones will repair it. I could take a shot with the manual, but there's no way I'm going to destroy that thing. It will get fully absorbed, that's pretty obvious. Unless I get a crit, which I have 0% chance to get. Yeah, that was a pointless shot. Why did I even take that shot? I should just shoot the mutant or something. Or shoot the drones? Yeah, I should have shot the drones. Oh well, whatever. I mean, I know this shot is going to get fully absorbed, but I took it anyway. What? Oh yeah, close combat specialist. This won't destroy it, but if the other drone moves, I might actually destroy it. I will destroy the sector pod on the next turn. Need to find some new cover. Regardless of the repairs that it will get. Come on, close combat specialist. No? Okay, whatever. But that drone moved twice. Okay, I can actually do it. Holy crap. I legitimately considered aborting this mission several times. Wait. If I take a shot... No, it's not on Overwatch, is it? If I take a shot with Conrad, will it shoot me back? I should take a shot with Emmanuel first. Yeah, because she has lightning reflexes. And I wouldn't want Conrad to get killed. Yeah, reactive sensors. Right, I'm glad I did it then. Okay, now I can take a shot with Conrad. Safely. Alright, let's do it. Rapid fire. Nice. I think it's going down right now. No? It's literally at one hit point. So, Valentina is going to finish the job. Yep. Down you go! Holy crap. That was just insane. This mission was insane. But I'm almost done with it. Fortunately. Let's actually finish it. Alright, drones first. So this one. Bagels can take care of the other one. And the mission should be done right now. Four civilians are still alive. Wait, what? Oh yeah, there's a mutant in the back. Right, I completely forgot about that mutant. Okay, that's not really a problem. 93%. 9 damage. It's still panicking, so... I'm just going to kill it quite easily. If not on this turn, then on the next one. Don is out of ammunition. Annette can take a shot or two. 7 damage, nice. I could actually use Mind Fray twice. No, just once. Can anyone else take a shot? No, just a net. Alright, he will die on the next turn, not a problem. That should be the last enemy in this mission now. Yeah, he's still panicking. Let's finish this. Come on. Alright, let's finish this. I'm glad it's done. 52%. I can shoot twice. Come on, don't miss twice in a row. That's a kill. And you actually got him next time. <laughs> what? It's not done? Come on, how is it not done yet, really? There are more aliens? Okay. I have no idea where, but alright. I need heals right now. Immediately. Yesterday. Where the heck are the aliens? I have no idea why it's not done yet. 
Is there some obscure alien in the back? Maybe there's some mutant that tried to run away earlier? I have no idea. Well, reload. You can move into cover or something. Reload. Let's go find them. They have to be somewhere on here. There might be one more mutant. Maybe that's it? Don't tell me there's like a full group? That would be crazy. Land? Why can I still not land? What? Really? How can I not land? Is this bugged? How is there an obstacle in the way? Are you seeing any obstacles here? Because I certainly can't see any obstacles here. Alright, whatever. So, more heals. Yeah, I'm just going to heal myself before I move any more than this. I don't want to take any unnecessary risks. After all of this. But I have no idea what kind of aliens there are still left around here. Oh, and yeah, I should probably save this civilian. <laughs> yes, get out of here. He didn't figure that out himself yet. Oh, okay, there's something on the right side. Okay. Muton? I think that might be a muton. Alright, can't see anything yet. Overwatch then. And it needs to reload. Overwatch. Conrad can overwatch. And you? Well, you can stay there. Okay, overwatch. Come on, we're friendly. It won't hurt much. More heals. Okay, one heal on my scout. Don't tell me there's like a full group in this mission still. That would actually be insane. Well, I guess we'll find out. Bagels, you can scout ahead a bit. I can't see anything. But this is a very close map. A very small map, so surely I'll see them very soon. There are still some civilians around here, which is pretty impressive, I have to say. Overwatch. Okay, let's move a bit. Annette goes here. Conrad could still use a heal, but not on this turn. Okay, Valentina can stay where she is for now. Come on, where the heck are the aliens? I think it's going to be a muton that was part of that muton group. Right, one more heal. This is actually the last heal that I can use. So I'll heal Conrad. Let's go find them. Oh, this way apparently. Okay. Still nothing. Where the heck are they? Bagels? Still nothing? Great. They have to be like on the other side of the map or something. I don't see any other explanation. Run into cover? I don't really want to dash into cover. I guess Jessica can do it. She's the assault after all. Still can't see anything. This is getting really weird. Valentina? Okay, she can go... Oh, she can't really move a whole lot. Apparently. Move into cover then. And Conrad? Conrad can go here. Don will stay where he is. I can't toggle flight. I don't see any obstacles here, so I have no idea what that is all about. Okay, whatever. Overwatch. Overwatch. If there is still one full group... No. I think I heard... A Seeker? There's still a Seeker in the back. Okay. And it just killed a civilian. That's not very nice. Yeah, I remember a Seeker in one of the groups that I triggered a long time ago. So that was it. There it is. Okay, let's go kill it and actually finish this. I think I had enough of this mission. So, rapid fire. 
Please don't miss too much. Thanks. Free damage. Would be nice to kill it before it goes into stealth mode again. It's down. And it should be done. Yep. Only 31 aliens? Felt like way more than that. But I guess that's because these were very tough alien types. This was easily one of the toughest missions I've done in this entire playthrough. This mission was just insane. And mostly because of this map, combined with the alien composition. I didn't think I'm going to finish this mission successfully <laughs> quite a few times. Okay, Conrad is wounded for 16 days, Emmanuel for 12, Jessica for 13. And Annette is fine. Only 14 Elerium. I should get way more than that. Plus 28 Panic. Hey, that's not too bad. It's on 1 to 100 scale. What's the situation? I think I'll have to consider doing Alien Base Assault in Argentina. I'll probably lose Brazil soon. But anyway, this part is done, so thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please consider leaving a like, and I'll see you next time.